Hey, howdy, hey, welcome to your welcome back to my channel. Um, for today's video, we are going to be going over some new announcements in the world of Drag Race and also what is going on for the rest of these next few weeks with Drag Race. So if that sounds good to you, make sure to hit that like button, comment down below, and hit that subscribe button. Come join the Sandwicher Hour community. And without further ado, let's get this video started. <laughs> Alright, alright, so, um, obviously, um, t today is Halloween, so first off, Happy Halloween, um, I am filming this the night before, so it's basically Halloween at this point, but with that all being said, we are going to be getting into some new updates involving two new series of, in the world of Drag Race, um, so I guess let's get right into it. First things first, um, Drag Race Italia recently put out their promos and their official air date and all the above. Um, Drag Race Italia is going to be premiering on November 18th, which is also happens to be Thursday. <laughs> um, so starting November 18th, we will be having Drag Race Italia, Canada, and UK will be wrapping up. So we will be having three shows of Drag Race airing on the same day. Love it. <laughs> um, but... UK should be wrapping up on the 24th or something like that, I believe, 25th, um, right or on Thanksgiving, actually. Wow, the premiere finale of UK is on Thanksgiving. Anyways, Drag Race UK should be wrapping up around then, um, and then, of course, we are getting Italia, like I said, starting on the 18th, and we still have Canada airing at this point, too. Um, Canada, I assume, is probably going to be going until December. Um, I don't know when the finale for that one will be. I'm sure I can figure it out if I really wanted to. Um, but I assume Canada will be wrapping up in December. Speaking of December, um, this is when we also have another show that is starting on December 2nd. Queen of the Universe has officially announced its air date. And they have also announced the judges for Queen of the Universe, including the host as well. So let's get into that. Um, the host of Queen of the Universe is going to be Graham Norton, who is, of course, a judge on Drag Race UK. So that's pretty exciting. And the judges are going to be Michelle Visage, Vanessa Williams, Trixie Mattel. Yes, Trixie Mattel is going to be a judge on Queen of the Universe. And I believe Leona, Will Leona Lewis. Those are the four judges for Queen of the Universe. It is, of course, going to be a singing competition. Um, again, we don't have any, I, I don't know who's going to be on it. I don't know if it's going to be, like, a cast per season and then they go whittle down to the end. I don't know. Um, I just know it's going to be a singing competition for drag queens. And, to be honest, I don't know if I'm going to be reviewing it. Um, just because it's going to be on Paramount Plus and I haven't launched, I haven't renewed my Paramount Plus. Um, just, I haven't gone around to do it. And I don't know if it's something I'm going to want to review. Again, I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions on that down below. I also don't know if I'm going to be reviewing Drag Race Italia, if I am being honest with you guys. Um, I can if you guys really want me to, of course. I'm, if you guys are always wanting, wanting these reviews, I will put them out. But also, at the same time, I'm not as excited about Italia. I don't know. Um, I'm going to watch it for sure and see what it's giving, but I don't know if it's going to be giving what I want to be reviewing, if that makes sense. Um, so Drag Race Italia is going on. UK is wrapping up. Canada is start going on. Um, we have a lot going on. And that's going to all bring us out to the end of this year. Of course, um, we also do have another announcement in the world of Drag Race. On VH1, there's going to be a RuPaul's Drag Race Christmas movie. Yes, Christmas special. It's called The Queen Who Stole Christmas, I believe is a title. It's featuring many, many, many uh, RuPaul's Drag Race queens, including one of my favorites, Heidi in Closet. So I got to do a shout out for Heidi, of course. Um, again, that is going to be airing on VH1. So I might be reviewing it. I don't know if you guys would be interested in a Drag Queen Christmas movie review. I don't know if it's something I could really review. I don't know. Let me know what you think down below. 
Um, but we have a lot of exciting things coming out as of right now. Um, UK is probably going to be wrapping up shortly. And I assume once UK wraps up, we are, we'll shortly be getting, um, international all-stars announced and all the above. So they are really going to keep us on this train going throughout the year and, and on to next year. So we have a lot of exciting stuff moving forward. Um, I will be reviewing still the main shows. I'm just going to be a little bit more selective with the shows I am reviewing. I don't know if I'm personally super interested in Queen of the Universe, which is why I'm kind of leaning against reviewing it. Um, just because... I don't know. I also haven't been putting on my Canada reviews. I've fallen behind on that and I'm just like, I like Canada. I'm just not, I'm not as excited about it. The shows I'm really excited about right now, obviously, are Dragula. Like, Dragula is something I will always be excited for. And of course, I'm going to re continue to review Dragula. Dragula review, by the way, for episode 3 will be coming out Tuesday. I promise you it will be coming out as soon as I can. Um, and yeah, we have some exciting stuff moving forward. Um, yeah, I don't know. That, that's about all I really want to talk about in this video. Of course, I can talk a little bit about Canada last week, actually, where we had this screech horror movie acting challenge thing. Um, that went pretty well. I enjoyed it. I think the queens did well. Um, obviously... The winner was, um, Adriana, so congratulations to Adriana. And the queen who went home, of course, was, um, who went home? Who went, si whoa, Stephanie Prince went home last week. I am falling behind, apparently. Um, but yeah, that was sad to see her go. Again, Canada's Drag Race is still airing. And I do want to give a special shout out to Brooklyn Heights. Her looks have been iconic throughout the season so far. She's bringing it for judging looks and oh my god, I'm gagged. Anyways, um, yeah, Canada's Drag Race is going pretty well. UK, obviously we had that double elimination last week. Um, so we are at a top five. However, I've heard there are four more episodes. So I'm curious to see how that's gonna go. Um, again, at this point, I miss Victoria Scone a lot on the show. And I miss Charity Case. Victoria and Charity Case, I think, were my favorites on this season. Just because they brought something so unique with their drags. And Victoria was so... Victoria was a funny one, honestly, on this season. And I feel like the rest of the season isn't... Hasn't been as funny. Like, I'm sorry, Scarlett. I understand people say you're funny, but I don't think you're that funny. My own opinion. Again, um, I don't know, that's just me. But, that does, that was a weird roundabout way to go there. But, um, obviously, UK is still airing. At this point, we'll see who wins. Um, but I'm excited for that. And, yeah, I, we have some exciting stuff moving forward. Um, let me know if there's anything else you want to see on my channel. Um, actually, earlier today, I do want to include this picture. Um, I was bored, well, not bored. I hadn't been doing makeup in a very long time, and I actually got into my Rose Quartz drag makeup, and I'm going to put a picture over here of it. I was really proud of this look. I thought I looked fierce. Anyways, again, um, it was just really fun to do it, kind of just for myself. But again, I of course, I will be doing videos again on the channel where we'll be doing drag makeup. But I just wanted to kind of do it for my own, for myself, which was really nice. Anyways, that does bring in my video, finally, actually, this time. Um, make sure to like this video if you liked it. Comment down below what you think about all this. And hit that subscribe button. Come join the Samateur Hour community. Follow me on social media, Twitter at Samateur Hour, TikTok at Samateur Hour, and Instagram at Samateur Hour. Like, share, comment, subscribe, and I'll be back here tomorrow with another video. Bye, guys.